Thanksgiving's right around the corner, so we've got a bunch of tasty toppings for your favorite pie here at Spark Fun Electronics. The Blinked from Pi Maroni is the easiest way to add eight addressable LEDs to your Raspberry Pi project. It plugs directly into the GPIO header, and there's an entire Python API for running all of these LEDs. Now, if you need more than eight LEDs, might I suggest the Unicorn Hat from Pi Maroni. This is similar to the Blinked, except that it has 64 super bright RGB LEDs, all individually addressable, and again, it connects directly to the GPIO header and has all of the Python support that you need to get started quickly. Sometimes it takes more than blinking lights to get the word out, so I suggest using the Displayotron hat. The Displayotron hat gives your Raspberry Pi access to a 16 by three character LCD with six individually addressable zones of RGB backlight. It also has a six LED bar graph on the side and six separate capacitive touch navigational buttons. It also breaks out all of the GPIO that it doesn't use to a header here, so you don't lose it by plugging this into your GPIO header. For basically anything else you'd wanna do with the Raspberry Pi, there's the Explorer Hat Pro. This is a multi-talented project board for your Raspberry Pi. The Explorer Hat Pro has four capacitive touchpads at the bottom, which each have their own addressable status LED underneath. It also has four more capacitive pads on the side, which are designed to clip alligator clips to. It also has this huge row of GPIO headers, which gives you access to the analog pins, the digital input and output, as well as all of the serial communication pins that you need. The other thing that this header gives you access to is two separate H-Bridge motor controllers, which makes this really good for small robotics projects or home automation. Finally, they've supplied a mini breadboard with an adhesive backing, which will stick directly into this space here, making it a great little prototyping platform for your Raspberry Pi. Finally, we have a Raspberry Pi shield from our friends at Bear Conductive. They're the supplier of conductive paints and inks, and what they've done is they've taken their touch board and rearranged it into a form factor that fits on top of a Raspberry Pi to create the touch board Pi Cap. The touch board Pi Cap gives you access to 12 capacitive touch inputs for building robust, high resolution capacitive touch and distance sensors. They've also included a couple of basic prototyping knickknacks, like a user programmable button, a three color status LED, and some prototyping area on the side with a GPIO breakout for all of the IO that the board itself doesn't use. Well, that does it for a special Pimp My Pie Friday new product post. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next week.